Hey, what's up everybody? Uh, I wanted to do, do a quick video follow-up on the Blizzard Hurricane board. Uh, my son and I have been riding it, actually my son more than myself. Um, we've gotten a lot of miles on it, have not had any problems with it so far. Uh, it's actually become his primary board. Uh, I can't stress the amount of uh, enjoyment that my sons get out of riding these even cheaper electrical skateboards. Um, the red board, the red uh, Blizzard board for us has been great. Um, fast, fast enough for the kids and quite fun. Uh, great to go on little rides around the neighborhood uh, and down uh, nice trails. So I have two boys. I ended up getting a second Blizzard Hurricane board. Same setup, single motor, green wheels, a different color coloration for two different kids. Um, same setup, same effort. Now I have had one problem with this board which I'll put in another video, but, but uh, Blizzard was very good to deal with. Uh, now of course I can't go without a board. Um, they've got two boards now and um, I've got a, uh, I ended up buying a WowGo 2S uh, longboard. Not the mini, but the long board. Uh, I'll have a video to come in the near future for that. So, the new board has been great as well. Um, like I mentioned, I have had one issue, and I'll post that in the next video. Um, it rides just the same, uh, very stable, very smooth, very fun. Um, uh, I, like I mentioned earlier, it is just really a good board, good investment, really. If you have kids that like to sit on uh, the couch, play video games, watch TV more than they do, play outside and run around, this might be your answer. Might not. Uh, it depends on where you live. If you have nice, nice trails around, uh, we do ride in roads occasionally. Um, no issue so far. Uh, stable ground, rough ground, does well. So, so I thank you. Uh, if you like this video, give it a like. Subscribe if you like that, and uh, I'll see you in the next video.